Hey guys, Mikey here. Welcome back to another short video of the data visualization basics in our tutorial series. So today we'll be looking at how to create histograms, in particular stack histograms. So for that, let's first install the ggplot2 package. So we'll be using the inbuilt dataset CO2. So it has five columns and we will be just working on the update column here. So as always uh, with the case of ggplot, let's create a sample plot so in the aesthetic here we will input what are, what's available we want to consider since we are creating stack histograms we need to give the fill here so this actually shows that how we want to separate our histogram so here we have like a couple of plans and we will be separating the uptake based on the plan so i'll show you the results in a bit so that it will be more, way more clear okay i need to run this thing yeah okay yeah finally we have it so this might not make a lot of sense because uh the count is very little here so we just have like for each category we might we have just one or two maybe like three maximum yeah but if you have a way larger data set and if you do the same thing you can get like a way more interpretable uh result and in case if you just want to create histogram you just need to remove the fill here and it should work so let's see yeah so this is a normal histogram well that's all for now i hope you guys found this video helpful i will see you in the next video ciao